guys. Okay, it is 6.56 in the morning. I'll be honest, we were gonna do a morning routine today and show our chaotic morning. However, Corey and I got off from the gym. Kesley's phone is in our bedroom. I forgot to take it down to her this morning. So her alarm obviously didn't go off. And yes, I'm wearing a hat. I'm sure you guys are like, oh, Shanna, the hat. Yes, it's the hat. I'm gonna go wake up my kids for school because we are running late. First of all, I need to take Lucy outside. Go potty. So I'll take her outside. She usually does her business. <laughs> and I sit here and wait until she comes back inside. She's going. So Cora and I got up this morning, went to the gym. Not every morning at 5 a.m. do I go. There are mornings that we usually go like after we drop the kids off to school. But if we have some important meetings or um, some just a busy day overall, we, we usually just go in the morning. But I personally like going as soon as I drop my kids off to school around 8.30 or 9. Is usually my favorite time to go to the gym, but today we got up and went at five, which had I not gone, I guarantee you my kids would have been up by now. So I'm gonna wake them up. Reesey PC. Good morning. Wake up, Perry Berry. Wake up. You got school and guess what you guys, we have to leave in about 30 minutes. We don't have much time. So we need to hurry. Yes, Lucy, I see you. Cora, do you want to get some breakfast going? Yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna wake up Kesley and Rhett. Rhett. Oh, he's not even in here. Oh my gosh. Children. Rhett. Rhett. Kesley, he doesn't even have a pillow. He just sleeps on the hard ground. You're so mean. <laughs> he could grab one. It's not my fault. Rhett, how come you always sleep on Kesley's floor? Just get up and scary. sleep in your own bed, dude. Or Kesley, even let him sleep in your bed. You guys. <laughs> Rhett, you've got a nice cozy bed you can sleep in. I know. I still see you. Yes, I see you. Get up, guys. Kesley, 30 minutes. It's 7 o'clock. We have to leave in 30 minutes. Rhett. Rhett. Vamanos. Gonna go. Ready for school. We're running late. Okay, so this is our, we'll just kind of show you a speed morning routine today since um, my kids are like asleep. And Corey and I are gonna quickly make breakfast. I'll help the girls get their hair done and get ready. Reese and Perry. Um, I already started the laundry this morning. So I usually, I did a load of laundry before I left this morning at 4.45 a.m. And so I got a load in there going, it's still going. I got four minutes left. And yeah, so <laughs> that was fun. I already done a load of laundry today, which is great. Kesley um, is always up usually about 5 a.m., 5.30 a.m. usually um, to shower or in general just get ready for school. Um, Let's see, uh, like we usually, like I said, if I get up and go to the gym in the morning, if we get up and go, we usually take Kessie's phone down to her. So it's in our room right now because um, we, um, I forgot to take it down to her this morning. <laughs> so look, there it is on my towels. Here's her phone. It's been in here all night. <laughs> I forgot to take it down to her. That is my fault that I wasn't able to take it down to her. So I think had that been on there though, Corey, she would have woken up. And so yeah, like I said, usually what we'll do is we'll drop the kids off to school and then that's usually the time we would go to the gym, but not today. And of course our kids sleep in. Do you think Kess is gonna be late for her first period? Yep. Oh, that's lovely. And the thing that sucks about when Kesley's late is it really does go against her grade. Like it's really bad for her grade. Let me get these kids back up. It looks, sounds like to me like Perry is still in bed. Perry is probably the, the hardest one to get out of bed in the morning. She just won't get up, no matter how hard I try. But Reese is probably one of my easiest ones. You slept in too. And you're usually one of the first ones up, silly girl. Hey, I see you. Now wake up. Look, you guys should took her stickers from her Valentine's that we bought and put them on her bed. You're so cute, Peppa. It's so soft. Can you wake up? Mm -mm. 
<laughs> you need to wake up. Can you get up and get, what, what do you wanna wear today? Do you wanna wear, cause they got uniforms at school. These are all their uniform pants I put right here. So she's got navy, tan, and black pants. Do you wanna wear this or do you wanna wear like leggings with, actually it's kinda cold today, so you're, it's snowy. So you're probably gonna wanna wear pants and boots. We don't go outside when it's snowy. You don't go outside when it's snowy? So do you wanna wear leggings and a dress or do you wanna wear um, jeans and boots? Just in case we might wear leggings and a dress. Leggings and a dress? Leggings and a dress? Okay, you'll have to wear your boots though still. There's some leggings, there's your navy blue. And let's get you a dress. Here's all her school uniforms. Um, let's see, do you wanna wear your gray dress? There you go. All right, child number four this is This is the way it is every ready. morning. The Always. Every morning. She's the only one ready and the only one here ready to eat. I thought I was doing No, because Lo Logan's number two. Even though Logan's not here, he's still my baby. He's still my child. Oh. So you are number four. Miss Reese is always the one. Okay, there you go. Yes, Perry's number five. And then these eggs for everybody else will be cold. Be cold because and the kids are going to half ready. of them won't even be eaten because they won't get here in time. Okay, I gotta go help Perry with her hair. <clears throat> Rhett is out of the shower. I'm gonna do his hair. He still looks like he's trying to wake up. <laughs> I know, I can tell. Well, at least you're out of the shower. So hurry and get your hair done. And did you already eat? Uh, no, I still have a little Okay, then, so hurry and get your hair done and then come and eat breakfast, okay? Okay, so, kids are ready. I don't know where Kessie went. Where did she go, Cor? Downstairs? I don't know. Where does Kessie always go? I don't know. Probably to her room. I didn't even see her walk through here. She's downstairs getting her backpack. Oh, she's getting her backpack. Okay. I don't look tired. So, oh, you put that in your hair? Your headband? I want nope. you to do my hair in a high ponytail. Okay, but I don't have time right now, Maurice, because we going to go. It's 7.30, and Kessley has to be out of the door right now, so we don't have time. Can I do it like that tomorrow, please? Okay, this is Kessley's. Okay. Kessley! Oh, my gosh. It's crazy morning. Thanks to my two youngest girls. That's for sure. Ready to go. Thank and then you. you and I haven't even eaten yet. I did. We got to eat. My still is not even I ate the leftovers of theirs. Oh, you did eat? And I just had a little oatmeal shake. Okay, well, I'm going to make me okay. some cream of make wheat. Make yourself some cream of wheat, Shannon. And, oh, yes, my yummy. favorite cream of wheat. And egg whites, my favorite. I don't like cream of wheat. I know, you guys are kind of sick of it, but not mom. <laughs> not mom. That's, that's the style of being healthy. You have to eat bland all the time. Not yeah. me. I but love you know, you can make it yummy. Wheat. You can flavor it with something good. Like I always yeah, flavor mommy. my cream of wheat with, um, what do you mommy, call it? I always mommy. flavor my cream of wheat with uh, stevia or, you know, cinnamon. I think it tastes good. You guys can try it. You can even put those um, crystal light packets in there. Kind of make it like the, like the mango one. It's really good in it, or strawberry. So good, so I don't have any of those today, so it is one of those. Look who made it upstairs. The princess, Kesley. 7.38, Kesley. You have to be to school in like six, seven minutes. Nope. And look, you guys, she's like a little baby. She takes her goldfish to school, and she even brings some for friends. Like, you take it for friends and hand it out. Like, it's so funny to me that, like, you have your goldfish. I'm gonna give the camera to Corey now. He's gonna take over. Oh you boy. guys have to go with him. Oh, boy. Oh, oh my gosh. This, well, this is we're reality. We're late. Where's your, are you serious, bare feet? It's 12 degrees outside. Where's your socks? You got them? Yeah. You got your shoes? Yeah. You got your backpack? Yeah. Got your coat? Yeah? yeah? <gasps> got your diaper? No diaper. Go get it. Right now. Perry, you ready? You ready? Are you late? Yeah. Oh, Lucy, are you ready? You ready? Well, just jump over. Just here. One hand. There we go, you made it. You ready? Reese, you ready? Okay, let's go. Here we go. Here, everybody wants to watch Kess. Here you go, Kess. Stop. Let's watch Kess eat breakfast. I never want to go outside. I like her sitting on my lap, she keeps me warm. <laughs> bye bye, Kess. Now let's go drop you Rugrats off, shall we? No! Yeah, Rugrats, no. Rugrats. Now going into their school to drop them off, it's just a line of cars. And so we have to hurry as fast as we can, and I hate 
being the one car that stops for like five minutes and piling up the whole line. Hi guys. So as soon as we get up here, three, two, one, go. Everyone's out of here as fast as you can. Right? Let's see how fast we can do it. As soon as I come to a stop, you ready? Three, two, one, bye. See you guys. Love ya. Have a good day. Bye bye. Bye. Love you. Love you too. It is good to be done. Thank you for joining our crazy school morning routine. Now you know what we go through every single morning just to get the kids out of the house. But once we do get the kids out of the house, party time. You ready? Ready to go home? Huh, Lucy, Lucy? You ready to go home and have a party? Let's do it, girl. Let's go home. Yes, I do you all the time. I like to.